Hi foodies, welcome back to another video. Today I'm making Jamaican curry goat. I started off by rinsing my goat meat with white distilled vinegar, lime, and here I fine tune the meat removing any excess fat or membranes to allow the meat to cook softer and tender. You want to do this at least two to three times until the water runs clear. I seasoned my meat with ginger, pimento, scotch bonnet, my green seasoning mix, Maggi All Purpose, adobo, black pepper, turmeric, complete seasoning, and betta pak curry. This is one of the best curries you can find anywhere in the world. I gave that a good mix and left it to marinate overnight in the refrigerator. To my pan, I added a tablespoon of vegetable oil, some freshly chopped ginger and allowed that to saute. Next, I toasted about 2 teaspoons of curry, making sure not to burn it on medium-low heat. I went ahead and added the seasoned meat, covered the pot and allowed it to spring its own water. To the leftover marinade juice, I added about 4 to 5 cups of hot water and once the meat was looking like this, I poured the mixture over it and allowed it to cook until tender. You will have to add additional water throughout to cook the meat until it's tender. Once the meat was cooked, I added some fresh seasonings, thyme, onion, scallion, and some more all-purpose. I also added some diced carrots and potato to help thicken the gravy. I cooked that for an additional 10 to 15 minutes, and once it was done, I served with a side of rice and peas because I am not a plain rice fan. Also some fried plantains and some tossed salad and this was finger licking good.